this child, whenever I get waffles for myself, he thinks I'm actually getting them for him. These are mama's waffles. And then he just takes it. Um, those are my waffles. Remember you already had breakfast? I fed him a breakfast of a whole banana and his own waffle. I cut up for him and everything. Then I go put my waffles in the toaster so I can eat them. And he takes them from me. Grayson, those are mama's waffles. Can you give it to mama? Give it to mama. It's mama's waffles. He acted so excited like he's never ate today. You already had breakfast. So my family came to visit this weekend. Um, ah! Yeah, um, they all came and Grayson was loving it because he was loving all the attention or whatever. And my mom, she's always surprising Grayson with gifts. And so she brought this cute little monkey chair. I'll show you. It's this adorable little chair, and Grayson is obsessed with it. Grayson, what does the monkey say? Ah, uh ah, -uh. uh -uh. ooh, ooh, ah, uh ah. -uh. Yeah, every time he sees it, he does his monkey noise, and he loves, it's so cute. It's perfect for his size. Oh, and he loves sitting in it, and it's cute because, like, he can't get on and off the couch by himself yet. So this is a little chair that he can sit in whenever he wants. He can get in and out of it. And it's perfect. It's so cute. Amazon Prime Days just happened, and I guess my mom said that it was a really good deal. So she was going to hold it till Christmas for him, but then when she saw it, she was like, I better give it to him now. And it's a good thing she did because it's perfect for his size, and he is obsessed with it. But this little thief is eating my waffles. Uh, those are my waffles. Yeah, Mama's waffles. It's so cute because he is talking so much more. He's learning a lot of animal noises right now. He's really into that. And he is just talking a lot more. He's learning more words. He's just like on that cusp of just like opening a plethora of new words and sounds. So it's super exciting to watch and to be there to like help him learn and like teach him. Hey, where are you going with my waffles? Come back. Give me my waffles. Those are mama's waffles. He's so confused, like, no, I'm pretty sure you got those for me. And there he goes. So the problem that I'm having right now is Gray loves to sit right here at the bottom of the stairs. And there's no gate. We didn't put a gate up at the bottom. There's one at the top around the corner, but there's no gate at the bottom because her walls are kind of funky and short. I don't think a gate would do so well. Anyway, so he loves to sit here and he loves to start going up on his own, like said. But he is not like good enough to go up and down on his own, especially not down, but even up, like he'll just stop and lean back and he'll fall down and it's happened before. So I always have to be behind him when he's going up the stairs, which is fine, except sometimes he just disappears around the side and I don't know that he's going up the stairs. So this is the problem I have is I have to like chase after him all the time. Where are you taking my waffles? Hey, oh, 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 he also likes throwing food. Oh, Grayson, what the heck? See, now he's gonna start to try to go down himself. You have to scoot. So I tried to teach Grayson to go down the stairs backwards like most babies and he's just not having it. He refuses to do it. So now I had to teach him how to scoot down the stairs, which he responds to a lot better. So that's what we do, but I still have to be there because sometimes he'll scoot, he'll scoot like halfway down and then the rest of the way, he'll just start to like walk <laughs> off the edge, like he's gonna tumble and it's not good. So where are you going?
There's Felix. Say hi, Felix. <laughs> and he's just taking my waffles everywhere with him. Can you stop? Those are my waffles. So today, um, Grace and I were going to go to library time this morning, or story time, whatever you call it. And then um, he'll take a nap, and then we're going to go and see my sister. She, this is the first time that she's able to get back into her classroom. School's starting in a couple weeks, so we're going to go help her see what needs to be done and hopefully help her set up her classroom, although Grayson's kind of destructive when it comes to things like that, but hopefully we can like keep him entertained. We'll see. What do you think, Gray? You shake it? So cute, they have little playtime after, after story time, so all the kids are playing. You loving these toys, huh? Are you sleepy? He's getting ready for his nap time. Such a cute program. Hey guys, so I'm editing this video right now and I just realized that I never clued you guys in or let you guys know that our plans completely changed for the day. So, like I was saying earlier, our plans were that um, this was the first day that Allison could get into her classroom. She's a teacher, she teaches fourth grade, and so Grace and I were going to drive to her school and help her set up and just kind of like take in note like everything that needs to be done and just kind of get an idea of like where she's at. So we totally had a plan and we were going to meet up and do that. While we were at library time, I actually got a text from my brother and he wanted to know if um, Allison and I and Grayson wanted to ride with him in the plane to Toledo just for the afternoon. Um, my aunt and uncle just finished building their house and they were having a like a little housewarming party with all my aunts and uncles and we're just going to like cook out and have some catered food and stuff and wanted to know if we wanted to come. And so Allison and I were like, yeah, sure, we'll come. So we ended up changing our plans completely and instead of going to help set up her classroom, we pushed that back a day and instead went to Toledo in the airplane. So here's, um, the next couple of clips will be like detailing all of that. But yeah, we went to Toledo. Um, the airplane was super smooth. Gray loved the airplane. He is getting to be such a pro. He loved turning the light on and off. Like there's a light on the roof of the uh, airplane and so he just kept clicking the button on and off. And he loved looking out the window. And it was so funny because in the past he's we had these um, noise canceling earphones for him and he's always like ripped them off, didn't want them on or whatever and he didn't care that it was super loud. So yeah, I think he's just getting older and realizing like, oh, these headphones actually like block the loud sound and it makes it a lot more enjoyable. So he actually kept the headphones on the whole time, which was really nice. So I didn't have to worry about like, oh my gosh, his eardrums. So he's doing, he did really good on the airplane ride. We made it to Toledo super quick, of course, because we were in the plane. The weather was perfect and then we went to my aunt and uncle's house they just finished building it and it was so beautiful um they did a really good job with it and in the back they had a pool which grayson was super excited about because he loves going swimming so of course i brought his bathing suit and little floaty and he swam and thankfully i have a bunch of younger cousins so they all got in the pool with him and we're just like uh, playing with him and you know swimming with him so I didn't have to get in which was really nice and then they also had like a little shallow end where Grayson could actually touch and so he was just like going around there for a little bit too so it was really nice and then they had like I said they were cooking out and then they also had Chick-fil-A catered so that was really yummy and then as soon as you know the party was over we just hopped back on the plane and went home and there was like a beautiful sunset on our way back and so it was just a really great day but a total change of plans and I never really addressed it on the vlog so I'm telling you now so here's um you know our little adventure that happened I hope you enjoy it I have headphones on Gray wait <coughs> ah that lasted long you had them on
made it to Toledo. Just a half hour plane ride and now we are swimming with our cousins. Well, my cousins. So Grayson's second cousins. Gray, are you exploring? I don't think he's been in sand, besides the like... Well, the beach. Sand on the beach yeah. Exploring the new house of my cousins, and Gray loves the dirt. <laughs> oh, it's a little unsteady there, oh, huh? Hands. Look, he's like, he needs, he needs help. Okay. Hey. Look, he's like, still. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, yuck. Yuck. Sand is yuck. Oh, yeah. no, we can... oh goodness. Oh, 